you're sort of between you and Domino. You're the romantically, well, certainly the, the real romance in the film. I'm glad you say that. No, I mean, it's it's more of a counterpart of the Anna Bronsky Cronin story. And I love the fact that, you know, Tom Stoppard actually put our love story into it and many of adaptions before have left, left it out. And I, you know, it's an interpretation of the novel. It's always, you, can, you can't put 800 pages down to two hours, but they chose to choose different kinds of love. and. I mean, Joe's obviously used a very theatrical setup for this film. Was it very different being in, you know, performing in this on set than it, any other film? Or? I think, I mean, when he told us about our idea, it was kind of overwhelming and you kind of, you, you couldn't get it into your head really what his vision was, but I loved how interesting it was, you know, regarding the fact how the Russians kind of put up an act of, you know, trying to belong to Europe in a certain amount of time. and. Um, no, but I, I think it was the same feeling that I had when I watched the film the first time. After, after five minutes, you buy the whole thing. And it was the same thing. You kind of got on set and he was like, yeah, Oblonsky's house is down in the basement. Yeah, that's how it is. And obviously you're sort of taking on a fair few English language roles now. Is that going to be the case? the course of your career you'll be UK well sort of English language based or will you continue well I before this I did this Danish film a royal affair where I had to learn a new language I would love to continue doing that and for me it's almost that it's different I just finished an American film and suddenly you have to go and do a new accent and you know that's a difficult thing but yes but I'm I'm right now shooting a small independent film in Sweden so I want to you know I want to focus on finding project scripts and directors and people I want to work with not specifically be it being an English film thank you very much it's been a pleasure